Good morning everyone and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I realized as I was editing this video that I didn't necessarily make an intro or an outro. So there's that. I'm making it right now. Today's video is going to be kind of a closet clean out but a bit different. Um, I decided to make myself a shoe closet. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoy this video and I'll see you guys. But my room my well my office glam room whatever is currently in shambles i mean shambles this is the current state of my closet and reason being is because i decided to go buy this shoe shelf okay i bought two of them because i didn't realize how big they were and even though they're so big i thought both would fit in here um they don't fit all my shoes. This one. There's another one identical to this. So it's like eight little sections. Okay, so anyway, don't mind the appearance. But I bought those shoe shelves because my shoes are literally all throughout my house, right? Well, I put this one up and I was like, okay, it looks cute, whatever. Which is the current state. I kind of have an idea. Although if I were to start this idea, it would take me absolutely forever. All of these clothes, I'm thinking about trying to make fit in my other closet. Well, let me show you the other closet and the situation with the other closet. So, this is it. Okay. The lighting here is god-awful, but this is it. Now, it goes back pretty far. It's dark and gloomy back there. But, in the back there is some of my... I'm watching... She's all that let me turn that off but anyway in the back there there's some of my boyfriend's clothes that he probably has no idea is back there so i was thinking about taking those clothes putting them in his closet because he has room shoving all my clothes down there taking the clothes out of here trying to fit as many as possible on the rack and then folding the rest up and putting them on the two shelves that are in there now, obviously, organizing the clothes would be a separate task. I don't know if I would finish tonight. But if I can at least get the clothes out of the way, because I don't want to just throw them on my bed or they're probably going to end up on the floor. So, if I can get the clothes out and into that closet somehow and know that I can get them all to fit, then I'm going to put these two little organizers that I have that have like my socks and random stuff in I'm gonna put those in that closet underneath because those were originally in this closet I know it's a lot so those will go underneath and then the little white shoe shelf in there will go in the middle of them that will be for my boyfriend's shoes he has quite a few in his closet but he just has like a couple extra that we put in there so I would do that and then I can build the other shelf theoretically stack it on top of here put all the shoes that are in this little thing like that's all my sandals and summery shoes i could put them all on the rack i have a bunch more shoes downstairs under my bed like everywhere and theoretically all of my shoes could go in one area then i can organize this this will be bags it used to be a lot prettier but i can organize that and then this top section that also has some shoes on it can just be hats and I mean it can also be some bags but that closet could be so pretty and then the other closet I would have to tackle after the fact as far as organizing like putting maybe summer clothes in the back whatever because that's the only difficult thing is you can't see the clothes in the back but I I could probably even get a light of some sort and tack it to the wall in the back there so that I can at least see them and I'm able to get them. But yeah, that's kind of my plan. I'm not going to do a time lapse or anything. Because I'm probably going to stand here like this. Majority of the time. But I'll come back. Once I've made some progress. So, pray for me. New year. New closet situation. More organization. We, It's going to look good. Okay, guys. So, little update. This is what the closet in my office looks like. The one that's going to be the shoe closet. I got all of the clothes hanging taken out. Please ignore the background. And then here's the shoe thing. So theoretically another one should fit. This is still scary. This is still here. And then I'm gonna show you guys the other room. So 
I took my boyfriend's clothes out of here and I put my clothes in. There's still that little bit of room right there. This is my bed. Okay, so I clearly have a lot more to hang up. And before you say it, get rid of clothes, I have a problem and it probably won't happen. So, and build the, let me shut this door because my siblings are so loud. Um, I'm going to build the next shoe shelf. Focus on the shoe closet, get that done. Because I feel like once I have something done, I'll feel better. When everything's in shambles, it stresses me out. So, once I do the shoe closet, then I can do these shelves. And these just have random bins of random stuff. So, I can find places for that. Which I know I can do because I was looking in them the other day. And then, these shelves I can use for my clothes. So, like, this shelf right here. And these also go really far back. This shelf right here, I can have hoodies. I could put like work shirts and things like that towards the end. Um, clothes I wear for specific things, dresses, rompers, whatever, I can organize. And then all of this can be like daily wear. Um, towards the back, I can put coats, heavy things that I don't wear often. That's the sitch. So this is gonna remain a mess for a while because I'm about to start the second shoe shelf. Also, there's two ways to build the shelf. You can either build it how I have the other one or you can build it and leave out a sleeve, which I think there's a picture. Okay, first of all, you can leave out like a sleeve right here for boots and I'm gonna do that because I have my cowboy boots and my rain boots that I would like to put there. So. I'm going to leave out the sleeve. Now, if I need the extra shelf space, I'll do that. But I really think with two, I should be able to fit all my shoes. If not, I have a problem. So, yeah. That's the current update. It is currently 528. So, it's not very late. But I'm a tired girly. Um, we're going to try to get this done as quick and efficiently as possible. So yeah, wish me an update. Second shelf is built. See how I left this out? That's for my boots. And I also think I might put my swimsuit basket there, but I'm not sure yet, so. Shoe closet is done for now. Um, I'm gonna go back through my bags and clean them out. But I wanted to show you. It looks so good. I'm literally obsessed. So here's the shoe rack. Basically full, which is a little scary because I have like 10 to 15 pairs of shoes downstairs however i think i can make them fit i might just have to resort to like the vans folding them kind of how i have like these but that'll be fine over here i have these little bin things in the corner and i have some boots right here and then i had these little things already in here from when the house was built and i just decided i'm gonna keep my belts and my like baseball cap hats on here and then i have a little thing that has a bunch of masks on the bottom and then over here, I decided to put my flip-flop sandal thing. Um, I did some little DIY situation. Don't know how well this is going to work. They were already ripped, so bear with me. But I just put tacks in the walls. And then I put these little hangers here. And so all of my sandals and stuff are here. And then I was a little bit smarter about it. And I put the ones I wear most on the outside. The other ones, if I want, I do have to like move a shoe. But I'm fine with that because they're all in one place. Then I organized this a little bit. Just to make it look prettier for now. And then like I said, those backpacks back there I have to go through and clean out. These are like my bigger hats. And then these are like backpack backpacks that are full of other bags. That are just like totes and things like that. But also I realized I have this part of the shelf. And if I want, I could hang... Some of these smaller purses and things just along here for more room and storage. So, anyway, I'm super ecstatic about that. I'm absolutely in love with it. I can shut the door. It's going to look pretty. And yeah, I'm obsessed. Now, I need to tackle moving. So, this is all clean laundry that I just haven't put away. But I want to move these bins into the other closet, put the shoe thing in the middle, put my boyfriend's shoes on that. 
and then start that closet which is the less fun and more scary one but that's okay so i'll update you guys when i come back with that progress yeah it looks scary however don't worry this is t-shirts slash kind of nice shirts long sleeves and this is this closet at the moment so i have some jackets i have like two like coat more kind of jackets um dresses and rompers crops i haven't organized these yet i have to put these in these piles they don't go in the piles they go up here three rows of sweatshirts i'm probably gonna need another up here i have some sweaters again sweaters um these are some jackets and jean jackets and back there you can't even see and it gets really scary but um those are cardigans so that's the current update um i'll update you guys probably when i'm about done with it this is the closet i have to clean out those my sock ones over there i'm gonna organize i'm gonna organize these i did like i organized like this bunch but i haven't organized all the way back there and then i have this semi-organized but it's extremely hard to get to the top shelf so i just threw those up there okay everyone that is the end of my closet clean out i hope you guys enjoyed um if you did please just give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below if you're gonna do a closet clean out i'm interested to see or just anything that you're doing to kind of clean up your space for the new year um but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys next time.